Brand new consoles are coming. Yeah. What? Yeah. Why? But they're not like sequel consoles. They're not like the PS5 or the Xbox 2. They're iterative versions of the systems that we have already. Yeah, that's going to get... E3 is going to be real confusing. Now, uh, you and I are both on Podcast mm -hmm. Beyond together. You are on Podcast Unlocked. Mm -hmm. You're, you, you caught this news yesterday with uh, everything that's going on with the Xbox One Scorpio. Yeah, the Scorpio. So the... Scorpio! The, Scorpio. Scorpio. the, uh, the leaks and, and reports are that uh, at E3, they're going, uh, X, Microsoft is going to reveal an Xbox One Slim, which mm -hmm. will come out later this year, and then the Scorpio, which will be sort of the system that is four times as powerful, run in 4K, right. possibly support Oculus, which would come out next year. But it would still have the same games as the Xbox One. They would just run better, much like the uh, all the reports of the PlayStation Neo. So I guess it begs the question, if new consoles are coming soon, what happens to your old one? Uh, the only way to really get rid of your old consoles nowadays are either to pawn them on Craigslist, where you could be murdered, sell them on Amazon, where you're probably going to make a lot of money. Mm -hmm. But uh, most clear case scenario is you bring them into GameStop. So uh, we thought we'd mock up a, a look at what GameStop's weekly ad will look like a year from today. Let's take a look. All right, so you get $25 off a PS4K Neo when you trade in your perfectly good PS4. Who needs that thing? Uh, this is a this is an artist rendition of what the 4K Neo looks like. Are we calling this art? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this is good. It's $700. It's got six USB slots now. Uh, if you trade in five copies of Uncharted 4, you'll get uh, $5 off Uncharted 4.5K, which has at least six or seven new trees yeah. and some rocks and probably one He's more got, box He gets more puzzle. gravel right up in his, in his Munda. Hopefully that's where the Vavuzalas are hiding because oh, they didn't have those. That would be wonderful. Uh, and uh, free Nathan Drake Funko Pop when you trade in your car <laughs> that you're probably living in by then. <laughs> uh, let's take a look at the Xbox side. Xbox One, we'll throw yours in the trash for you for free. <laughs> You don't need it. And it takes at least two people to lift that thing up, so <laughs> there it goes. so big. Take a look at the Xbox Slim. Man, how did they make that? That controller is going to be hard to use, <laughs> but it's so skinny. Uh, the power brick is still gigantic, so don't worry about that. And the Xbox One 2 Scorpio, because you want something as ugly and powerful as your gaming PC, but you don't know how to build one. Also, down below, a little PSA from GameStop. We sell groceries <laughs> now, and snacks, porn, booze, whatever. Anything to stay in business, so please visit us. Please. We're begging you. And finally, Nintendo fans, don't worry. Things are looking up. <laughs> or not. Wii U, just come on in and take one. They're practically blocking the door. Uh, everything must go on the clearance sale for Nintendo. Wahoo! The NX is here, and it's already on clearance. Turns out ignoring third parties and shipping underpowered consoles with weird-ass controllers for 10 years has its consequences. And finally, GameStop. We buy and sell used clothes now. We're basically a Salvation Army, but with slightly less homeless people and slightly more strategy guides. <laughs> It's I, about to get dark. How did I get to see those before they went up? That was really It's cool. about to get real dark.